Good morning. Just a few months ago, we made Apple Watch available to our customers around the world. There are already over 10,000 watch apps on the App Store. And see and hear translations in over 90 languages to control your GoPro. And now the app turns the watch into a viewfinder. Dr. Cameron Powell, co-founder of Airstrip. While she's doing this test, she can actually listen to the baby's heart rate right on her wrist. We've been working with a company. This is a company that shares our commitment to excellence and craftsmanship. And that company is Hermes. We're really excited to offer two new finishes, gold and rose gold and anodized aluminum. The new models that you saw are shipping today in these 24 countries, and Watch OS 2 is available on September 16th. Next up is iPad. We have the biggest news in iPad since the iPad. The bigger screen iPad, your TV shows and movies are more cinematic. The games we play are more immersive and powerful. It's 12.9 inches on that diagonal. It's 2732 by 2048 pixels. Do the math, it's 5.6 million pixels. That's even more pixels than a 15-inch MacBook Pro with Retina display. Over the last five years, they've grown performance in the iPad 22-fold for CPU tasks. And graphics tasks are even faster. We've doubled the performance of graphics over the A8X. And over the last five years, this is unbelievable. Graphics performance has gone up 360 times. It is faster than 80% of the portable PCs that shipped in the last 12 months. At graphics tasks, it's faster than 90% of them. With iMovie, you can now edit three streams of 4K video simultaneous, 10 hours of battery life. So for the first time ever in an Apple product, we now have a four speaker audio system. And it, but iPad Pro is going to enable new classes of applications that require even greater precision ever possible before. A new level of precision and accuracy that requires some amazing innovation. So we're so happy to introduce to you another brand new accessory specifically for iPad Pro. It looks like this. It's called Apple Pencil. When you're using the pencil, the system scans twice as often, allowing iPad Pro to capture more points in a single stroke. Highly responsive sensors built into the tip of Apple Pencil work with the iPad Pro display to detect position, force, and tilt. Microsoft Office, Kurt Konigsbauer. Kurt? Now watch as we can use the Apple Pencil and circle items in our document. We can strike through, we can add suggestions, and we can write in the margins. And you'll see it's also great for multilingual usage too. Eric Snowden. With Sketch, we've really tuned it to work with Apple Pencil. It's, it's incredible. And with our new watercolor tool, if you use the pencil on its side, you're laying down more water and less pigment. If I use it upright and press harder, I'm laying down more pigment and less water. Most impressive thing out of all this, if I put three fingers down on the screen, I can scrub back in my history, back to my blank document, and then all the way back to my final design. 3D for medical, Irene Walsh. Using the pressure sensitive technology, I can model the effects of arthritis, varying the size and the frequency of bone spurs according to force that I apply. Of course, our great Touch ID. The end is a configuration with 128 gigs in LTE networking. I'd like to talk about an even larger screen and that is your TV. The future of television is apps. Joey Family Movies, animated only, just the new ones. We're introducing a brand new operating system for your Apple TV called TVOS. They use familiar tools like Xcode 
and they have access to great iOS technology. There's a small indie studio from Melbourne, and this is where Crossy Road on the new Apple TV really shines. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, mate. For the whole family, designed specifically and exclusively for Apple TV. All right, this guy here is Throbot. Watch how Mike hits his rhythmic pitches by actually swinging the remote. The better his timing, the higher his score. So let's say you're watching the Mets, but over in the AL East, the Blue Jays are also trying to clinch the division title. Well, MLB TV can send you a look in notification so you never miss a moment. And the best part is, when you open the notification, we can take you straight to split screen. So you can watch both games at the same time. For a full three months on a single charge with typical use. And when you need to recharge it, there's a lightning connector right on the bottom. 64 gigabytes for $199, and it joins the existing Apple TV at $69. Over 80 countries and 100 countries by the end of the year. Next up is iPhone. Next up is iPhone. Next up is iPhone. In fact, at a worldwide level last quarter, iPhone grew at three and a half times the rest of the industry. This is truly remarkable. And then in, in China, it's even more incredible. iPhone grew a stunning 75%. I am thrilled to show you the newest iPhones. iPhone has changed the world. Four metal finishes, silver, gold, space gray, and the new rose gold. I'm trying to imagine how you take multi-touch to the next generation and further deliver a new experience that's just as profound as the first multi-touch. And they've really done it. It's called 3D Touch. 3D Touch works on the home screen, giving you shortcuts to the things you do frequently. It also works inside applications themselves. Press lightly and it gives you a peek at the content. Continue pressing and it pops you into the content itself. This is the next generation of multi-touch. Andy Wafer. The 3D Touch adds an entire new dimension to the gameplay experience. Now, players can press to smoothly zoom in or out or press a little deeper to switch to a heavier weapon like this battle cannon, all without taking a finger off the screen. New second generation Touch ID sensor. It's twice as fast, so it's so lightning quick now when you touch it, you can't believe how quickly it recognizes your fingerprint. All new iSight camera, in fact, it's a 12 megapixel iSight camera. Goal was D, which when we zoom in, you can see the incredible level of detail and sharpness from that 12 megapixel sensor. Panoramas are loved by our customers. This is a 63 megapixel panorama photo. Now for the first time in an iPhone, 4K videos. In every frame, there are 8 million pixels. Along with the iSight camera, we have a new FaceTime camera. It's a 5 megapixel FaceTime HD camera. So we're going to use the retina display to be a retina flash, in fact, one that matches the ambient lighting color and could be a true tone flash. What if you could press with 3D touch on your photos and this happened? This is entirely new technology. It's called live photos. These are still photos. They're not videos. They're 12 megapixel high quality still images with all the incredible effects you want on a photo. But we extend the capture moment just before and just after you took it. And we do it in a space efficient way so they don't take up much more room. It has LTE advanced, so it's twice as fast. And there are 23 bands. Wi-Fi is faster too, it's up to twice as fast. More and more Android customers are switching to iPhones. You're going to find a new app on the Android store from Apple that you can download to your Android phone. When you set up your iPhone, it will make it easier to get all your important information over to your iPhone. 4K video editing, new five megapixel FaceTime HD camera, a retina flash on the front side so you can take FaceTime pictures in low light. And of course, I think you're gonna love this feature when you get to use it, live photos. And the 6S and 6S Plus take their place at the Tomba end of the line.
The iPhone upgrade program, you can get a new iPhone every year. When you get it, you choose your carrier. It is an unlocked phone. It includes the Apple Care Plus program, and it starts at just $32 a month. And again, it's a 24-month installment, but you can get a new iPhone every single year. And then it'll be available in just two weeks, September 25th, in the following countries. On iOS 9, come available just next week on September 16th. A full terabyte for $9.99 a month. So that is all the great news on the new iPhones. Back to Tim. Pull three, two, one, slowly. Pull. And upward, up, up. 